A walk turned tragic in the North Country. Tonight we're learning more now about the young boy who was killed along with the man who was going to be his stepfather. News 10 ABC's Connell Smith begins our team coverage speaking to friends and family of the victims hit when a motorcycle went off the road in Lake George. Balloons, flowers, a teddy bear and a cross all make up a roadside memorial where a family was struck by a motorcycle in Lake George Sunday afternoon. 38 year old Jamie Persons and eight year old Quentin Delgadillo were killed when a motorcycle being driven by 33 year old Anthony Futia, who state police say was riding at a high rate of speed, ended up on the bike path along Route 9 near Lake George Expedition Park. The mother of Delgadillo, Jasmine Llewellyn, was also injured and is currently at Albany Medical Center. Her birthday happens to be Monday, just a day after losing her fiance and son. And how can she celebrate her birthday? You know, you can't. But just everybody, just, just pray for everybody that was involved in this accident. And you know, let's be careful on the roads. Let's not speed in the, on the bikes and in the cars because this is what happens. Eight-year-old Quentin Delgadillo was a third grader at Lake George Elementary. Late Sunday night, the school district sent a note to parents offering condolences to the family and stating the school will have counselors on hand for anyone who needs support. Mary Bradley is a friend of the family. She says Quentin was loved by many and enjoyed playing sports. He was just a very outgoing kid, loved people, had a lot of friends. You know, same with his other siblings. They're beautiful, loving children. And for them to have to go through this, the sister of Jamie Persons, who did not want to be on camera, drove six hours from Pennsylvania to view the memorial and be with family. She says the family plans on creating a memorial fund to cover funeral and cost of living expenses. In Lake George, Connell Smith, News 10 ABC.